It's good to see you. Thank you for coming. Today we're going to take a review and check out the Eddie Bauer jacket. The Eddie Bauer jacket, the new one that they have here is the men's Microtherm Free Fuse Stretch Down Hooded Jacket from Eddie Bauer. Thanks for coming to uh, Raven's View. Stay tuned and we'll check it out. All right, ladies and gentlemen, this is the review of the Eddie Bauer stretch down jacket, the free fuse. And um, I saw the ad for it, uh, let's see, about a month ago or so. And I said, man, I'm going to have to definitely check this out. I have a lot of Eddie Bauer gear that I use all the time and have. So I thought this would be a great addition, especially because it's getting to be cold out here right now. And so um, I have uh, a lot of uh, other types of jackets and things like that, a few different down jackets. Um, but one thing that was kind of interesting for this one was two different things. One of them was um, that it's stretched, so the whole material actually has a stretch give to it so it's a stretch that goes across like left and right so you can kind of you know stretch your arms uh, back and forth and, and out and the whole jacket stretches this way it doesn't stretch up and down but it stretches this way <clears throat> which is uh, which is which is just right I think um, the other thing that was really interesting is the way that they made this jacket and um, normally with a lot of down jackets there's stitching that goes across and stitches all the way across to keep the down feathers inside the jacket in one place well this and then that stitching then potentially has holes because the needle goes through and then that hole has air that comes in and out um, well I guess in for that matter in really for the cold air that allows the cold air in um, this is a little bit different. It has kind of a fuse that they, um, well, what's the word, I guess, fuse? It's kind of like fuse, I think. So the, it, it's fused, it's kind of sealed together. So the material is um, kind of heated up, I, I think is really what it is, heated and, and, and just kind of fused together um, so that there's no actual ho holes that go through the material all the way across it. So that keeps the cold air from getting in, which I've noticed in some other jackets um, on when it's windy out or something like that, uh, you can definitely feel some of the cold air coming through a little bit more. So anyway, that's uh, that's one thing or a couple of things I, I really enjoyed about or one to uh, try this out. The other thing that's kind of neat is the cuffs on here. So the cuffs on the jacket um, are a little bit different. So the normal cuff on most of the other jackets are, are like this, but on the inside of it, it has this little stretchy triangle that comes up. And that stretchy triangle helps to pull this in a little bit closer to your arm and um, keeps some of the draft and air from getting in through your, your cuffs and sleeves like that. Let's see, uh, the other thing is it has a hood. Um, this one only comes with a hood. So this, uh, this hood, does not have a drawstring in the back, um, so you can't tighten it, and you can't tighten it down here either. So a lot of hoods have, you know, straps you can tighten here and in the back. This one is just kind of one, one way, but it does stretch. The hood itself does stretch itself. The material does. Plus, there's also this little extra band, I guess, that uh, that goes around it, um, or or cuff, I guess, the hood cuff, that goes and and keeps keeps the hood um, up on a little more, a little more better. Uh, the other thing is this zipper garage, which is really nice that not all uh, the jackets have. I really appreciate that for, for when you zip up your zipper and kind of tuck this in so that <clears throat> when you're moving around and stuff, that zipper doesn't kind of pinch in on your skin or neck or things like that. Um, so that's pretty good. So there's the, the hood as it is kind of zipped up. <clears throat> pretty nice and warm um, and it has a little bit of a flex to it like I said too so it's supposed to allow um, you know some helmets and things like that to, to go underneath it <clears throat> so um, there's a zipper up top <clears throat> and this one actually um, goes way up here so it's a pocket that starts actually up to here and all the way down and this is a, a, one of the, the uh, reversible pockets so that there's a zipper on the inside, so it's a packable um, pocket, so that you stuff everything inside and into this pocket, and then kind of have a little pouch, and then pop it out again. On the outside, there are a couple pockets here. Uh, one on the ins uh, either side, zippered up, <clears throat> and they start zippered down, and they go upwards to to close, and then down 
to open up. <clears throat> so those are nice and warm um, on the inside. There's no fleece or anything on the inside like that, but uh, but they still seem pretty warm. And the other neat thing about this one, it has an inside pocket, one inside pocket. So on the inside of the right hand side, there's a big pocket that you can stick a bunch of stuff in. Uh, not on the other side though, so just on the right hand side. <clears throat> and also on the inside, there is a drawstring that goes around the bottom of it. And this is only on one side, so it goes all the way around the entire bottom part of the jacket from here and loops around to the other side. So you can take that, cinch it up <clears throat> when the air is uh, kind of a little breezy or the, the weather's a little little windy to cut some of that wind or maybe you just kind of like that style it, to have it a little cinched up closer on the bottom around your hips and and and, uh, and waist and stuff like that uh, let's see um, the other thing is uh, it has the 800 fill so the 800 fill power for the for the down and that's printed on the, the jacket here uh, which is really really nice uh, the higher quality down is the higher the number the higher quality <clears throat> so 800 is, is kind of up there on the definitely higher end of the scale of the quality premium uh, down and so some other down jackets have lower quality you know like 400 600 uh, somewhere like that so this one goes up to 800 this is also similar to the 800 down fill in the other um, micro therm Eddie Bauer jackets that I have a couple of and I'll show you as a comparison, in a, with a comparison to that. So if you have those those other ones, um, and you might consider, you know, this one. This one is definitely warmer than the Microtherm um, other Eddie Bauer down jackets uh, from their, this is the first ascent uh, line. And so the other one, um, the other Microtherm jackets are not quite as warm as this one. Uh, I've noticed that for sure. Um, so anyway, I'll, I'll take this off. And you can kind of see it here. <clears throat> Looks pretty good. And I'm going to put on just for comparison. One of the other weather <clears throat> Eddie Bauer microtherm. <clears throat> Microtherm jackets just to give you a comparison on kind of what it looks like here. Uh, this is a size large, so is the other one that I just had on. <clears throat> um, this one has a stretch to it, but it's a stretch panel. So underneath the arms and kind of around by the back shoulder, there's a little kind of a stretchy material that, that has a little bit of give. So when your arms are moving around and things like that, it, it kind of has that little flex. The other part though is, is that flex material um, is really thin. So you're losing a lot of heat there. <clears throat> Um, and this one has, of course, the, the stitching that goes all the way across, like I was talking about. So a lot of the regular jackets that are, that are made for down have stitching that goes through to keep those um, um, feathers in place all the way through. But air can get through that stitching <clears throat> and be a little cool. So uh, this is nice to kind of use as an under jacket uh, or something that is, you know, maybe not quite as warm out or not quite as cold out. But you could see kind of what it looks like in comparison to the other one here. And so right now in Juneau, Alaska, it is, the weather is getting a lot cooler. So uh, I am definitely appreciating this down fuse, free fuse jacket. And uh, it's helping me keep a little bit warmer on these cold, frigid days. So <clears throat> that's pretty much it. Um, I'm pretty, uh, this is, and so like I said, this is also a large, and just for size comparison, for others that are kind of thinking about, let's see what size to get, uh, I'm about 5'8 uh, and about 180 pounds, and this one seems to fit just right. I think of a medium, uh, for me at least, I have a little bigger shoulders and a little bigger chest that uh, I found that some of the mediums are just a little too tight on me for the most part, so this one uh, ends up fitting a little bit better. Um, so that just gives you an idea of what size you might be interested in or if you're getting it for somebody else. 
Um, if you have any questions or comments, let me know down below. I'll put a link to uh, where this is at so you can see. It goes to the uh, Eddie Bauer site and, and, and the jacket this is here. Um, and I think that's, uh, that's about it. So far I'm really liking the jacket and I just wanted to do a quick comparison, quick review of how, uh, how it's gone. I've been wearing this for about a week or so now in this cold weather and it's been great. I really enjoy it. Uh, I like this color as well. It's nice and kind of a bright color. Yeah, so far. I'm, I'm digging it. So it's really good. So hopefully that was helpful for you. If you ended up uh, liking this video, then like it. And that means give it a thumbs up. You could subscribe for more content, more views, uh, more how-tos, more lots of other things like that. You can learn Tlingit language if you want to as well. I put some videos up on that, different culture from Alaska, um, and a lot of other things. So subscribe, share it with other people that you think might like it, and uh, we will see you again soon. Suyei Kwasatin, Gunas Cheese.